Welcome to the Phyla Trading Card Game Invasive Species Edition. It's time for you to become an ecosystem architect. In this game, we'll be building Canadian ecosystems and exploring different events such as invasive species that threaten them. The objective of the game is simple. The person with the most points wins. To set up, grab a deck and a friend. You can use a whole deck for a full game or 20 cards for a quick game. Put your home card facing each player, divide the deck in two, and you can start building your ecosystem. Each time it's your turn, you can draw one card and make one action. You can discard a card and pick up three new cards. You can place a species down onto the table to build your ecosystem, or you can move a species card that's already on the table. See the move instructions on the species card to see how far that species can move in an action. Always remember to place the card facing you so that you can count your points at the end. The first card you need to start building your ecosystem is an autotroph species, or a species that produces its own food. Look for the number in the top right hand corner of each species to see how it gets its own food. The other card features that will help you build your ecosystem are the type of terrain the species live on, the size of the species, and the point value. Make sure to read your card for special instructions. The table setup is similar to Domino's, with each new card having common features to its adjacent card. Each species you add to the ecosystem must be of same terrain, must be of the same trophic level or higher, and it must be of same size or bigger. Now, for the most important feature of the game, how to defeat your opponent. The deck contains a series of event cards that you can use to destroy your opponent's ecosystem. Check your event card for information on which species it can destroy. Play your event card on your opponent's species card and they'll have one turn to save it, either by playing a species protection card or replacing the species card altogether. If your opponent cannot save that species, then that species card and all the other cards that come after it are discarded. The first person to run out of cards in their draw pile initiates the final round of play. The player who drew the last card will have three final moves for their last turn. Then, their opponent will have three final moves. This will end the game. Count your points at the end. Whoever has the most wins. For more game situations and details, check out the hard copy instructions. Thanks for joining us and becoming ecosystem architects. It's time to start building.